Sucharita, could you please give us the information on the Narasimha webcast? Lolita Devi is facilitating. You could not find it. Oh, it's in Palai Center Academy, and you should be able to um, purchase the Narasimha birthday, I believe it's called, unless someone else has it. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Eva put it on there. I just had to scroll down. Okay. So did I miss any of the questions or comments that were posted on the Zoom chat? If I did, then copy and paste it now. There's so many that get put on there all at once. So Sharita. Beta. Hi, good morning. Uh, How are you? Oh. Beta, can you hear me? Can you hear me, Beta? No, it's my internet. I'm sorry, can, can you hear me? Anyone else, can you, would you like to post a note on chat if you can hear me? You can hear me, okay, maybe it's better. Okay, great. You get to see all my weird faces. Oh, I can't hear. <laughs> uh, I love this program. Everybody's so relaxed, family. Okay, so I'm not sure Beta can uh, share her experience or ask your question. So Estelle is saying sometimes it's difficult to write or speak in English, but know all my love and gratitude to you, Sujurita. I listen to you every day and all you do. Aww. Okay. okay, let's try one more time, Sujurita. Hi, Beta. How are you? Yeah. My internet is keep on going in and out. Anyway, I was gonna I was gonna say that last week when you mentioned Naher uh I did the the Google search, right? And uh, and YouTube I found this mantra that somebody was singing and I thought it was so beautiful. And uh and they have picture of Nara seeing him, you know, like the lion and he's taking this man apart. And and in my heart, I didn't see that as bad. I thought uh, I, I felt so much love for this entity. That... Oh, Beta, you cut out again. So sorry. So I think what uh, Beta is sharing is uh, about the lion man ripping out the guts of this guy. So this guy is this um, uh, demon. He gets into everybody, and it makes kind of it kind of makes sense because when we take in something that we uh, that causes indigestion, you know, we take in words, and it makes us to not feel so great or we take in food or water or something that we take in and we we, it goes through our digestive, of, digestive system and we try to assimilate, we try to absorb that energy and it just doesn't sit well. That's like, uh, you know, demonic energy, they call it. Like it's like a um, negative force that is congesting and it's trying to get in and make us to feel a certain way and we don't resonate with that so how to get that energy out of us you know how uh, normally we feel sick so we try to you know, like throw it out or we try to get rid of it other ways detoxing whatever and it still doesn't go away that's an energy so we got to go to the spirit realm and call on this divine being to come in and rip it out of our guts so He's also a strong force that will prevent us from having any obsessive thoughts that we keep digesting 
and absorbing and re absorbing and assimilate like it just keeps going on and on over and over and how to interrupt that pattern uh, that we've brought from another lifetime it's not even this lifetime it just keeps getting expressed and in ways that are not desirable so not a symbol will kind of just rip it out because it needs to get ripped out we can't stop it any other way or we can't take a pill not a summit is the pill and, and you'll feel it in your belly so you know it as you experience this release in your belly chakra in your navel chakra then it frees up what your solar plexus the one the energy center that's just above the belly and then when that gets freed up then it's your heart center and then your throat and then your third eye so all that will get cleared out with his grace and blessings but he's going to rip out that which you cannot digest any you can't take it in anymore you can't assimilate it you don't want to keep reabsorbing it and sometimes we can't get out of situations like with family uh issues or with our work or with uh anything in life even with our own obsessive thoughts about god knows whatever happened in the past it's so we can't even cut our mind off from that so he will go in and rip that out of your guts and then you will feel so much relief because all that energy will just be flowing and your the energy will go higher and higher and lighter and lighter so so sorry better we can't get a good connection today oh let's try um, again <laughs> okay let's try again maybe it's the charm uh anyway when i looked up in the internet and nara singha i saw this um mantra and it was so beautiful and uh i wanted to uh so when i went to sleep at night i had this tremendous pain in my side in my side like a stomach you know like really bad and i signed up for the uh for the Homa in Astro bed for, for, and, uh, and then, then I wanted to, to know the words to this mantra because they were so beautiful. And yesterday they sent something for that course. They send the, the words for those, for the mantra. So it's like, wow, I got the words for the mantra because I, I, I I liked the, the uh, mantra so much, but I just didn't understand it. And, uh, and also when I saw the picture of him ripping people apart, it's, I, I just thought I, he was doing a service of healing people instead of being this, because Dr. Belife have mentioned that this, this, the atheist is feared by a lot of gods and, but, I didn't see him as a fearful uh, deity. I just see him as a compassionate deity that he's doing this service for, for people, taking this out of their bodies. But anyway, that was my experience with Naira Singha uh, from last time that you talked about it. And oh, what... beautiful. So you're connecting with him, Beta. Yes. Oh, good. It's, it's like I feel this compassion for this for this uh being rather than fear uh, yeah absolutely well he's feared uh, dr fly is sharing he's feared by other uh divine beings because they can't uh, play tricks you know he's going to just yeah. take that away because sometimes when we're tricky in life it can backfire on us or it creates uh, problems for other people so you can't mess with him he'll just rip it out yeah, so anyway, that was uh, my experience. A beautiful, yeah. Veda. Thanks. See, three's a charm and you're connected. Yeah, right. God bless. Yes, Mean. Hello. Thank How you. are you? Thank you. I'm still awake, but I can't. I just want, want you to be reasonable, go to bed. But um, it's so beautiful to be part of it, and um, thank you for sharing, everybody. God bless, Sveta. You did a wonderful job. Thank you for sharing that. It is so important that um, um, the souls are 
leaving this body as peaceful as possible to have a good start to go um, to the upper realms and not stay caught here around in the lower realms or in the lower astral realms. I have a lot of experiences with that and what you explained ah just beautiful god bless thank you for sharing that yes meaning are come, you are you speaking about uh shweta shweta yeah shweta's yeah. brother so um and then something very different i didn't i don't know if it fits here but um oh my god i'm also so in love with Narasimha. oh since i'm i'm wearing his um uh, the mala with the head, the lion head. And I have a little problem and I thought, oh, maybe I just sneak it in and ask you if you could help me. I was, um, uh, because um, I sent some emails out to Pillai Center and on the Wealth Rising Facebook group, but no one responded because I think everybody is might be busy with celebrations. And I, um, I did sign up for the immersion, SB immersion program. Mm -hmm. And there's a um, um, code, a gift code. You get $100 for any Pillai Center Academy programs or courses off. And that is, um, and, and uh, so when you purchase the program, normally you get an email and then you get your gift code. And that was my plan to buy my Narasimha um, program, okay, to celebrate his birthday. But um, um, so forth and back, so Pilai Sender did not see, uh, Shiva could not find the payment, but I sent him everything. I sent my bank, bank statement, it's deducted. I sent my PayPal confirmation, and there's nothing is happening why ever and whatever it doesn't matter 14th moon and whatever and but if someone could organize that i get this 100 per, the 100 dollar gifting certificate the code emailed you see because i purchased it and everything is there i confirmed it all in the emails um I could actually still be up for the job to to, <laughs> to um, do the program in the time frame. You see, yeah. Well, I don't know if you are the right person. Here's the thing: what I can suggest for you, Yasmin, is yes. to uh, when you write to them, then copy me on the email as well. Uh, add me to the email chain, uh, and then because uh, we don't know what's going on on this weekend. Uh, whether the officer is is open or closed. So okay. what you can do is purchase the product or the service or the program, and then uh, get the program, get started, and then you can get the refund afterwards. Okay, yeah. That's what right. I would suggest as a, as a stopgap. If it's in the middle of the week, we can get it done, but it's on the weekend and here it is. Yeah. So okay. I wouldn't want you to miss it. Right. Okay, I signed up anyway for the Full Moon Fire Lab now. Oh, good! And we'll see it tonight. So, so we will. So we, I will be there anyway. And thank you so much because it was it was really beautiful to to be to celebrate uh, Narasimha's birthday here with everybody together with you. It was so wonderful, so deep, so warm, so loving, so my. Gosh, we are so blessed. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, thank you, Yasmin. We'll see you tonight. Yes, see you tonight. Lata. Hi, Sucharita. Hi, Lata. You're such an angel. You're such a blessing to us all. I admire you so much. Aww. First thing I want to send my deepest condolence to Shweta. Mm -hmm. I met him in person in New York City. It was awesome. Uh, very quickly, New York City was so awesome. Oh my God. Divinely planned for me. The goddess just picked me up and dropped me there. <laughs> and I, I found... Uh, 
I purchased some uh, old, old uh, from 2007 DVDs of Babaji and there's so much information. It's almost like things that should have come to me in 2007. All of a sudden I have, like he's giving it to me now. I'm so, I've been so engrossed in it. I've been just, there's so much information. It's like, wow, wow. And then um, while I was in New York City, I went to Shirdi Baba Temple and also Ganesha Temple. It was so awesome. And then I, in the DVDs, Babaji clearly said, he's wearing the wrap around his head. He says, in my past life, I was Shirdi Baba. And I just got up and started jumping and <laughs> joy. I didn't know that. <laughs> it was so good to know all those. Um, it was so great. I don't know how to describe it. Uh, it was like um, now when I received the meditation and I'm listening to it, it I know I, I, well, of course I was there, but during meditation it seems like I don't know where I was. I was not sleeping. It's like, what? Did I miss this? Or like, what happened to me? I, I hardly recall any of the meditations like in person over there. And the energy in that room, oh my God, Sucharita. I This is only the second time I've been in presence of Babaji. My first time was at uh, Guru Purinima last year. Oh my God, I don't know how to describe it. It was so awesome. It was like, I'm so glad uh, Shreem Busy, the goddess, made it possible for me to be there. Um, I'm very, very grateful. It was truly a blessing. Anyway, I cannot find the link for Full Moon Fire Lab for tonight. Can, I've been looking. Can you send it to me, please? Oh, my goodness. I'm not sure why it's not. Can you go on to specials? Wait a second. Maybe I have it here. I'm going to just post all the links that I copied and pasted in case people like yourself asked. So they're all going to go on to the chat. Okay. There you go. <laughs> Thank you so much. You're such an angel. I love oh. you so much. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, Lata. Enjoy and we'll see you tonight. Okay. God bless. It's so amazing, you know, when people go and see Dr. Ply in person, it is the best because you get to actually experience going into that altered state where you are out of your mind, out of your body, out of your all your problems and all your worries, all your anxieties, and you're floating in this uh, consciousness that is so, so supportive, so loving, so uh, empowering and rejuvenating. And so, and when he, when you were sharing Lata, I, I don't remember the meditations. That's why we have it, these recordings. Thank God we're in this age and stage in our evolution where the internet uh, technology and recording is available for us to receive the teachings afterwards because it's it's like that anytime and that's the best when you just get out of your mind you get out of all your worries out out of all your problems and he takes you into your soul and you meet yourself your highest self your true self for maybe the first time every time because our soul is growing along with us it's evolving along with us and as we get initiated into a teaching, especially in the presence of Dr. Ply, it really does a lot of good. I know, thank you. And um, Babaji himself said, I didn't come prepared for this. I didn't know what I was gonna talk about. The you can't, and you start to see. Yeah. Lata? Hi, yeah. sorry. Was I talking over you? I'm sorry. My internet, oh, okay. funny things. Okay. I was just saying that Babaji himself said, Lata, I can't hear you. I, I'm not sure what's going on with the internet. 
Can you, can people hear me? You can't hear me? Oh dear. Oh, you can hear me. Okay. Maybe it's Lata. Okay, so um, we'll go to the chat. 